Hi everyone, I'm back for my six month milestone for my hair journey and I guess you can say I'm kind of excited. My hair has grown way more than I could have ever imagined it would grow. Of course I had um, I had the goal of bra strap length by my one year mark and um, even though I had that goal I didn't really know if I could achieve it or not. Now I'm feeling pretty confident that I will achieve um, bra strap length at my one year mark which will be in October and right now it is the end of March. So this is basically just going to be a length check. I've described in many of my videos what I've been doing um, to my hair in order to have it grow. So if you want more details on that you can click either here or here for those videos or you can go to my blog post for um, my recent updated hair routine because it does change quite often depending on um, what I read about, what I learn, and what I think might be more helpful for my hair. I try to get hair. as straight as I possibly could but it's not straight at all. Um, it's very poofy so it's still probably not exactly the length that it really is because it's not relaxed but it's definitely grown a ton. I'm going to show you the back. So this is the back of my hair. This is the back. And I'm quite excited for the growth. side and this is the front so I think it's grown a lot I think I'll definitely make it to a bra strap length by October because it's pretty much at armpit length it's super funny because I'm going to wear my hair out like this tomorrow with my roots like sticking out really far I think my new growth is like literally from here to here and then down here is like more relaxed, more straight. But I'm going to wear it out like this tomorrow because I don't have time to braid it up tonight. So, and it doesn't look too bad. And another thing along with my hair growing, uh, my nails have been doing extremely well too. Which is funny because even though my nails used to grow, they would always break. So right now, they're not breaking at all. They're all the same length for like the first time in forever. And they're getting long and I think I'm going to have to cut them. I noticed that every time around the time that I do my hair update, I always end up doing a nail update and deciding that I need to cut my nails because they have gotten too long and too hard to deal with. And it's about that time where... I'm going to cut them, but I never cut them too short. I just cut them enough so that it's easier to get things done and not have to worry about breaking them. So yeah, I'm going to have an updated nail routine as well or what I've been doing with my nails to get them to grow long and to also not break. Um, I'm going to have that up pretty soon. I have noticed well. that I've been doing things a little differently with my nails and using different nail polishes that have really been beneficial to my nails and my nail growth and maintaining the length without them breaking at all. So I'm pretty happy that they're all the same length and they all um, are equal. I like it that way. So yeah, this is my hair. It's pretty exciting. I kept looking in the mirror last night when I saw how long my hair was. I was like, oh my goodness. But it's kind of annoying because um, I'm not used to my hair being this texture and for some reason it bothers my neck. Which is really weird because like all night and all day I was trying to get it off my neck because it was bothering my neck. I'm going to have to get used to this. Because I usually, you know, take my wigs off when I get home so they don't really bother my skin or bother my neck. But this I can't take off. So it was definitely bothering my neck. Making my neck itch or uncomfortable. So I'm going to have to see how I get used to this used to texture because when my hair is straight and silky soft it doesn't bother my skin at all but with my hair 
like a little coarser and thicker it definitely feels a little uncomfortable up against my skin So yeah, check out my blog and check out the links um, on the side for my other hair um, videos so you can see where my length used to be and where my length is at right now. And if you think it's grown, I definitely think it has. Anyways, talk to you guys later and I love you guys. Bye.